Hey everybody, Edwin Williams here, and I am here to talk about what just came to my door today, and that is my tech kit from Los Angeles Film School. Um, what I have is, I have the first tech kit when you go to school at uh, Los Angeles Film School, after the first four or five months, you end up getting a nice little package where they send you your MacBook. Now, I didn't do a video for my uh, first package, but I decided to do this one because I haven't seen any for LA Film School uh, in regards to the tech kit, the second package for digital cinematography. So, I'm going to show you ah, the first box right here. We're going to open it up, see what comes in it. Now, of course, this is the uh, camera package. Uh, to help with completing the course. Um, they send you a Sony FS5, lights, tripod, the whole shebang -a bang all right, to get you through this, uh, your program. So, and I've been like reading up a storm on the Sony FS5 and everything that it entails, everything it does, all the bells and whistles, all the accessories that you can soup it up with and I've read nothing but really good things really positive things uh, some of the cons that people have are really not something that I really I guess dabble in too much with so it's not really something that would affect me in my day-to-day -day as far as what I film um, I'm more of a you know, short film and really I try to do all, all I can like a music video short film uh, features whatever I can get my 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 hands on and wherever I can get myself on the set. So, and so they made sure this box is very secure, by the way. Not that I'm struggling or anything. All right, got it open. Let's see what we have inside. All right, first up, they send you nice little Sony headphones here. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, ECM VG1. Your mic. You're gonna need this bad boy. Your mic. Now, a lot of people use a uh, external audio sy uh, system, so you can still do that. But I've heard some really good things about how the audio is for this camera. Next up, what do we have in here? We have our travel bag. That's right, because this baby costs a lot of money and you need to make sure that you keep it well secured. This is a very nice bag. It's a Porter Brace. It actually comes from Bensington, Vermont. And it actually says that on, on the front of the bag, just in case you wanted to know. At every waking minute of the day, Vermont makes bags, cameras. Ah, it says memory card. Let's see what kind of memory card they gave us. Alright, so when you get your camera, whenever you're watching this, and I'll be sure to do a review on the camera as soon as possible to give you my feedback on just um, picking it up and seeing what I can do with it and how uh, user-friendly it is and how user-friendly it may not be. So I'll be sure to get that up and running. This is a 64 gigabyte card. Yeah, 4K. Now the camera, uh, it shoots raw, it shoots um, 4K, slow-mo, all that good stuff that you can look up. Now I'm gonna make sure, like I said, I, I go into full detail about the actual camera itself. And here is a box within a box. This box is the camera. Safe to assume. As I get this open, and I've been really looking forward to this. Currently, I'm shooting this right now with my GH5. Uh, Panasonic makes excellent DSLR cameras. I have my G7, my GH5 that I'm shooting with now, and then of course I have my uh, T3i, my Canon T3i that I started with um long ago that i still have but uh the gh5 is what i'm filming with here 
And I feel like this camera's gonna be, because one, it's an excellent companion piece for my GH5, for my G7. So, um, as and I can pick and choose which one I want to be my A camera, which one I want to be my B camera, as far as when it comes to the Sony FS5 and my GH5. So, as I pick this up, it's all in little compartments, by the way, so I'm just letting you guys know that. Uh, Let's see what we got in this little the first compartment. A lot of people probably like already have this already set up when they do these little videos and whatnot. Uh, as you can see, I am crisply uh, fresh as a daisy opening the box as we speak and unwrapping. All right, first we have ah nice little the grip side grip where you can uh. Basically, zoom in, zoom out. Cord button right there. Perfect little hand grip. And you can actually buy an extend arm and use it almost like a shotgun, almost not a shotgun, but a, I'm just gonna look at Uzi or whatnot, a, a camera Uzi, like da, 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 you know, what kind of thing. Sorry about that. So we're gonna put this to the side. Oh. Next up. Ah, LCD screen. The camera, the like I said, I'm gonna do a full review, but the Sony FS5 has a ton of different ways you can configure the camera. So you can actually place the viewfinder on all sorts of different little parts. It doesn't just necessarily have to go on one particular part of the camera. Ah, I know what this is. We got the lens cap. Bubble wrap for later, for my own enjoyment. And this beautiful, ooh, so crisp, so clean, so shiny. Let me tell you something. This is an 18 by 105 with four f-stop lens, uh, E-mount. And uh, of course, I, with all the lenses I have for my Canon and for my Panasonic cameras, I'm, of course, going to get adapters for these to be used on the FS5. Only makes sense. So, whew, so beautiful. I'm going to actually put this back in the bubble wrap so I will not be playing with it right away. Remote control for reasons. I'm not going to lie, probably won't be using this. pack what's this what's this what's this got like ah for the viewfinder we've got our power cord for battery pack reading materials because you can't just jump in like a video game and just wing it even though I am going to do that in the beginning I'm not even gonna lie probably once this video is done I'm gonna just put it all together and just go shooting butterflies. That's a lie. It's, I don't think there's any butterflies. It's still kind of cold. But I'm going to shoot trees and things. One big old battery that they send with it. Now, I've been uh, seeing that a lot of people say you need to get at least two or three or get the, there's like a bigger battery. Definitely get an additional battery. I would say that for any camera, for filmmakers, you should all know this. Get yourself an additional battery. Oh my gosh, there's been so many times that shoots have stopped or come to a standstill because when you have only one battery, that means you're going to have to charge it at some point in time during your shoot. Let's see what else we got here. And this up. Ah, this right here. The handle where you put the mic through. Another uh, beautiful, and you can zoom in, zoom out. Very nice, very nice. Very sturdy. It feels so sweet. Ladies and gentlemen, this right here, you know, it looks smaller on um, when I see other videos and uh, of this camera and when I see it online, but you know, it is small, it's, it fits in the palm of my hand, and although I, I have, you know, you know, I have decent sized hands, but it's actually pretty, uh, it's, it's very, very light, if I can say that, very light, um, very nice. I like the the feel of it. It's very sleek, 
see where everything goes here. Nice, nice, nice. Very, very, very nice. Nice little viewfinder right there. Like I said, the Sony FS5 4K. Um, you say it's good in low light. I'm going to be the judge of that. I'm going to test this baby out and I'm going to give you my full review. Guaranteed, no filters, everything you need to know about the Sony FS5 from a filmmaker like myself, um, who is, um, I've been doing this for now three, three years, and I can be honest here. Uh, I'm going to, you know, I've started from handheld cameras to big mini DV type cameras, and, you know, uh, I'm not the, I would say, the guru that throws out super huge terms. I'm going to give it to you straight, straight and narrow, no filters. Later on, though, not right now. I'm going to have fun with it first. Okay, this is nice. I like this. So nice. It, it even smells nice. That's weird. Don't judge me. I'm going to do a quick cut. Uh, show y'all what I'm looking at, what I'm about to lift up and put into, in front of the camera. But it's a very big box, uh, which I'm sure is the lights, tripod, um, and other hula hoos and diddly dots. Hold on. Yay, more bubble tape and bubble wrap. Kids will have my daughters, two of them, will enjoy tearing this up. Baggies. Ah, oh, what is this? This is an extension cord. Ah, oh, for my mic. 25 foot cable. Oh my god. Just in case you want to do external audio correctly. Bam! I can tell I'm a little excited. Just a little bit. How about that? They send you an actual boom mic, people. Boom! Goes the dynamite. This is a rod. Select the arm kit. Again, for uh, secondary audio. Which is awesome. A boom hole holder. There is about... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine of these fantastically 65 photofluorescent daylight light bulbs, spiral. So they give you a lot of these lights for your light kit. So right now I'm gonna show you pictures of what the light kit will look like. I have a ton of lights actually. Uh, with these three lights that they send you, uh, that brings my total lights to, uh, I think I have 10 softbox lights now. Head grip. Universal shock mount. Mounts on camera shoes or boom pole and grips. Have a ton of tripods. A ton of them. But this tripod, there are many like it. This one is mine. Manfrotto tripod. Now, if I have to put this together, I'm going to give y'all the quick picture. But, oh, this is beautiful. It's all black and red, red and black. Here we go. Bam. This thing sturdy, heavy. I can already tell. I got to put it together, though, people. So, uh, I will have that demonstrated for you guys later. But, uh... That was actually a lot more fun than it needed to be for me, and that's probably because I'm a big man child. But nevertheless, this is the tech kit package number two, Dose, um, that we have, uh, that Los Angeles Film School, LA Film School has sent me, and uh, I'm happy to have shared that with you. If you guys have any questions about the school, um, the packages that you get and anything like that for digital cinematography, bachelor degree program for the online program, feel free to leave me a comment below. I'll be sure to get to you as soon as possible. And like I said, I'm giving you no filter, no, no substance, no sugar, no additives, no rubber tusks, nothing like that. I'm going to give it to you fresh. The real deal Holyfield, I'm going to give you everything you need to know about the school, the equipment, everything. So be stay tuned. 
to see me test out the camera, test out the gear, and thank you so very much.